Hello, my name is Marley, and I'm a midwife and antenatal teacher from Now Baby Live. I'm going to show you today how your uterus contracts to dilate your cervix, um, bringing the baby's head down. And I'm going to show you this using a balloon and a ping pong ball. You may well have already seen this demonstration before online, but it's quite a good way of showing you exactly how the womb works. So I've got a balloon here that I've already blown up. And you might not be able to see, but there's a little ping pong ball that's actually settled in the bottom of it. So the balloon is going to act as your uterus and the, the part here that you blow into, that is the neck of your womb. So during your pregnancy, you may well find that you get some Braxton Hicks contractions, which are just um, quite light tightenings on the side of your uterus, which might, might make your womb go a funny shape and your belly look a bit funny on the outside, but not enough to actually put you into labour. When you're in real labour, the, the, the womb is in two segments, so you've got the upper segment and the lower segment, and they work together to contract to um, bring the baby down and to dilate the cervix. So the top of your womb starts to contract, and it actually draws up the muscle fibres, the uterine fibres from the lower segment of your womb, brings them up, and that's how it shortens the cervix. So I'm just going to show you. So this is a contraction here. So we're going to squeeze the top, and as you can see already, the neck of the womb has started to shorten. So these are the strong contractions. So your cervix has gone from about two to three centimetres in length to probably about one centimetre. Now this can take anything from several, several hours to you know, 10, 15 plus. So this is like the early stage of labour. After your, your cervix has started to shorten, you'll find that it's, it becomes very, very thin and then it starts to dilate. So we can already see here that the cervix is dilated about a centimetre, okay? baby's head won't be showing at this point but that's how it will look inside and then we keep going and then over time the contractions get stronger and stronger until you are fully dilated so the cervix is more or less vanished the cervix is dilated by about 10 centimeters the head is crowning and we're ready to um, to deliver the baby keep going you can see here the head is now crowning and just a few more, we'll see the birth of the baby. Thank you very much for watching. If you're interested in finding out a little bit more about our online antenatal classes, please go to www.nowbabylive.co.uk. Thank you.